and welcome. Congratulations. Friday morning, you made it through another week, and it's uh, the 8th of May, 40, as we wake up and head out the door this morning. Looks like uh, around 8 o'clock, we should be around 50, 67 by noon. Our high today, 72, well above average. Things are looking pretty good. Plenty of sunshine. Winds are going to be light. It's going to be a great day. Looking at the satellite and radar. A little bit of cloud cover early in the morning pushed out uh, the remnants of the full moon uh, visible this morning. And, and now it's not quite the full moon, but it's still pretty cool. And you'll see more of it tonight. It'll be at 97, 96% tonight. Um, we're going to continue to have uh, energy, moisture, rain, snow into parts of Montana throughout parts of today. The 24-hour forecast. Now we look at what's going on just in the Spokane area. And just a, a few clouds perhaps bumping around Deer Park into Coeur d'Alene later on today. Um, overnight it's going to be clear and, and boy I tell you what it's just really going to be a nice day. Nice way to wrap up the week and a nice start to Saturday morning. Our highs day are going to be in the low 70s. We're going to be upper 60s, low 70s into the Coeur d'Alene region. And then um, mid 70s as we look at Moses Lake Wenatchee. Uh, Lewiston, 75. And then uh, Pullman's going to be about 70 degrees, 69. Looking pretty good. Saturday, 74. Sunny, looking good. Mother's Day, partly cloudy, breezy. Some winds firing up for Sunday afternoon, evening hours. Uh, just be aware of that for any barbecue action you may be doing. Um, just, you know, be prepared. Uh, Monday, uh, partly cloudy, 70. We'll see things change for the middle of next week with more rain coming in Tuesday, Wednesday. But we'll get to that at a later time. Overnight lows are going to be mild. Going to be a beautiful weekend to get those gardens in, get things planted, put the flowers in. And uh, I don't know, it's just really going to be a nice weekend. I think everyone's looking forward to it. This is just going to be a picturesque couple of days. I'm Mark Peterson. Thank you very much for watching this. Your First Alert Weather app is free and available to you at the App Store. And also, 4 News Now, uh, news app also free and available to you with push alerts letting you know what's happening in and around the country as it happens. That includes all the local news as well.